Reports are just in that a new strain of the novel coronavirus, SARS-CoV-2, has been discovered in Wuhan City in the Hubei province of China. We all risk getting it and spreading it to others. Wash your hands with soap. Wash our hands frequently. Its origin is thought to be a wet mark. Its origin is thought to be in the 5G network. Novel coronavirus disease spread can be stopped. Here am I, and I don't know. Should I believe what they said? The world's gone crazy with this information frenzy, and I'm just about to lose my head. There was sad, my life was quite normal. Studying at college for my degree. Then coronavirus hit us, now my life is on hiatus. I don't To be a grown up where initiative is shown up, but I'm hidden behind the mask. There was I, my days were quite normal, living life independently. Then they put us in lockdown, and our dreams are all shut down. I don't know who I'm supposed to be. Stop now, not enough. Freaking boring, bored to tears, to sleep, to death, to do. Ooh, that was quite exciting. Ooh, that was quite exciting. We almost had something to do. Do, 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 do. Internet connection unstable. Internet connection unstable. Internet connection unstable. Internet connection unstable. Professor? Professor? Professor, please! Student connection unstable! Student connection unstable! Student connection unstuck! Student connection unstuck! Student connection unstuck! Student connection unstuck! Unstable stew! Unstable stew! Unstable stew! Unstable stew! Turned into two, 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 hardly human, hardly stew. 
students. More like animals in cages, caged up at the What's to say? No more left to say. I'm dying to sleep, I'm dying to sleep, to die to sleep, to sleep, to dream, to dream of school. Where students actually meet, where teachers actually teach, where people actually greet, where hands actually reach. Where I can touch you, where you can see me, where we can breathe each other's breath. When we speak, when we speak, when we speak. Each 
Good evening, my name is Camilo Castillo, and this is the 2020 news. January, for the first time since the Great Recession, women outnumber men in the U.S. workforce. Donald J. Trump becomes the first American president to attend the anti-abortion March for Life. And breaking news: Kobe Bryant has been killed in a helicopter crash.、Uh, the Center for Disease Control confirms the first case of COVID-19 in the U.S. Impeachment proceedings begin against President Trump. February. The Academy Award for Best Picture goes to *Parasite*, the first non-English language film to receive the award. The U.S. reports its first COVID-19 death. The Dow Jones plunges by the largest daily points decline in history. The Emmett Till Anti-Lynching Act, first proposed in January 2019, passes in the House of Representatives. White men chase and kill Ahmed Arbery while he was simply out jogging. No arrests have been made. March. President Trump declares COVID-19 a national emergency, and three quarters of the country locks down. Box office revenues hit zero for the first time ever. The Dow Jones falls ten times further than the Wall Street crash, then jumps to the biggest gain in 90 years. Arizona bans transgender women from sports. Trump's approval rating rises to 49 percent. Daniel Pru dies after being restrained by police. Breonna Taylor is fatally shot in her bed eight times by police. April, the U.S. has more recorded COVID deaths than anywhere else in the world. The economy shrinks in the worst contraction since the Great Recession. 22 million filed for unemployment in the worst crisis since the Great Depression. True religion filed for bankruptcy. No more designer jeans. The CDC recommends face masks while Texas opens up its beaches, and President Trump orders the commercial exploitation of various celestial bodies, including the moon. May. Trump threatens to shut down Twitter. 100,000 people die of COVID in the U.S. Operation Warp Speed accelerates vaccine production. Worldwide anti-Asian racism explodes. George Floyd is murdered by police officer Derek Chauvin. I can't breathe. Protests are held. Trump tweets that when the looting starts, the shooting starts. Instead, fire season starts. Hurricane season starts. An earthquake hits Nevada. June. COVID cases exceed two million. Trump refers to the pandemic as Kung Flu. DC 16th Street Northwest is renamed Black Lives Matter Plaza. Trump plans an election rally in Tulsa on June 10th. Trump postpones his rally. 
Juneteenth is commemorated across the U.S. Rand Paul holds up the passing of the Emmett Till anti-lynching bill. Richard Brooks is killed in a parking lot by a police officer. Protests break out. Tropical storms Cristobal and Dolly form. 25,000 acres of California burn. July. Florida becomes the COVID epicenter of the world. Over 2,000 hate crimes against Asian Americans are reported. Federal law enforcers are sent into Portland's black civil rights protests. Trump threatened to send in the military, white supremacists, and murderer. Daniel Lewis Lee is executed in Indiana. The Supreme Court demands Trump's financial record. Hurricane Tana and Isaiah's form. 345,000 acres of California burn. Connie West announces his presidential candidacy? Are you kidding me? August. While the Republicans nominate Trump and Pence for the presidential election, the Democrats nominate Biden and Harris. Harris is the first African Asian American woman to be nominated for vice president. The National Rifle Association is accused of financial mismanagement. Trump bans TikTok. Jacob Blake is fatally shot by a police officer. Protests break out. Three million acres of fires in, uh, in California burn. Pizza Hut's largest franchise declares bankruptcy. No more cheesy dough balls. September. <laughs> Police footage shows the fatal arrest of Daniel Prude. Protests break out. Two sheriff's deputies in Compton, LA are shot in their patrol car. Trump calls to defund diversity and sensitivity training. In the first presidential debate, Biden calls Trump a clown, liar. Supreme Court Judge Ruth Bader Ginsburg dies. Trump nominates the right-wing judge Amy Coney Barrett. U.S. COVID deaths surpass 200,000. President Trump is... President Trump is nominated for the Nobel Peace Prize. Hi. <laughs> Century 21 declares bankruptcy. No more prime real estate. October. More than 9 million cases of COVID-19 are reported in the U.S. POTUS and FLOTUS test positive. Trump withdraws the U.S. from the World Health Organization? House Democrats discuss invoking the 25th Amendment to evaluate the president's physical and mental health. Walter Wallace Jr. is shot and killed by two police officers. The national debt passes 27 trillion for the first time ever. Oh, and Ruby Tuesday declares bankruptcy. No more Ruby relaxers. November. Biden wins the presidential election, but Trump claims it. He demands that vote counting stops and alleges widespread fraud. <laughs> Multiple lawsuits are subsequently issued and projected. Election officials declare it the most secure in American history. Pro-Trump protesters march in Washington, D.C. National COVID cases surpass 13 million. Four states legalize recreational marijuana. Ooh. Oregon decriminalizes small amounts of heroin, cocaine, and LSD. We need all the help we can get, folks. The Dow Jones exceeds 30,000 points for the first time. <laughs> 350 transgender people worldwide are reported murdered. Those are the known cases. Despite the hurricane, tropical storms, Arthur, Bertha, Cristobal, Dolly, Edward, Faye, Gonzalo, Hannah, Isaiah, Josephine, Kyle, Laura, Marco, Nana, Oscar, Paul, Renee, Sally, Teddy, Vicky, Wilfred, Alpha, Beta, Gabe, Alpsil, and Zeta, Ada, Ada, and Iona, not to mention over 2 million acres of fires in California alone. Trump with us. For the Paris Agreement, all climate change. <laughs> Happy Holidays! December! Saturn and Jupiter condone. Oh. National daily COVID cases and deaths continue to rise. The states return to lockdowns and mask mandates. An emergency use of Moderna vaccine is authorized. One person is shot, four are stabbed, and 33 are arrested at a pro-Trump protest in Washington, D.C. No charges are leveled at the two officers accused of killing 12-year-old Tamir Rice in 2014. Trump's approval rate sinks to 39%. The Emmett Till anti-lynching bill is still sitting in Congress. The best-selling movie of 2020. Happy New Year. <laughs> Welcome to 2021. I'm going to look at Let's hope it's a better year. January. Trump still refuses to concede the election. January 6th. Senators meet to count the electoral votes at the Capitol in Washington, D.C. On Pennsylvania Avenue, President Trump incites thousands of Stop the Seal supporters who stormed the Capitol. Five die. Hundreds of Capitol Police are injured, and hundreds of protesters are subsequently arrested. Twitter, Facebook, and YouTube suspend Trump's accounts. Finally, 
Trump becomes the first U.S. president in history to be impeached twice. Uh, Two thirds of Republicans still believe Biden wasn't fairly elected. NRA declares bankruptcy. Does that mean no more guns? COVID-19 continues to grip the world with over 95 million cases. More than a quarter of those are in the U.S. and over 3 million are in California, with 1 million of those being in L.A. County. Vaccine delivery is serious delays, but in exciting news, Mickey's and Minnie's runaway roll race is set to arrive at Disney's Hollywood Studios in March. <laughs> and NASA's Perseverance rover is headed for Mars. Oh, my mother. Did I come to? And I hope it's going to be 
everything I dreamed of, everything I see, because I'm the 21st year of the 21st century.